Hi! So today we are going to make a southwestern fried rice from Taste Buds. I'm so excited. I love my Taste Buds. Has anyone ever been able to tell I love my Taste Buds? Um, we're going to get two tablespoons of oil here in our pan. And you're just you get to squeeze. Isn't this dispenser so cool? And one of the things that I really love is if you can see, it has the measures so you know exactly how much you're getting. I need to get another one for some of my other oils. So we have, we've added some oil and then we're gonna add our fried rice and I'm doing a double batch. So I have, two cups and then in our measure all we got two more cups love the measure all isn't that so cool it just pops right down in there all right we're going to kind of squish that around a little bit and then i'm going to add four tablespoons of the Southwest seasoning mix, Southwestern. Well, it called for two, so I'm doing four. I think I doubled the recipe today. Right, and then we're just gonna mix that all up real well. And it says you can use brown or white rice. Get it all mixed up. Ooh, it smells really good. Real spicy. All right, you got it mixed up pretty good there. And then it says to just let it sit in a pancake form for a minute. I'm gonna let that set just a couple of minutes and I'm gonna grab some eggs. <clears throat> Cause it calls for eggs in a little bit. Whoops, that wasn't good. I dropped an egg. And Bandit's helping me clean the egg. All right, so whoop, wash these off a little bit. They come straight from my chicken house a little while ago. Always crack them first into a container. There's one. Recipe called for two, so we're going to do four. There's two. So, you can 
see our eggs. Then we are going to, oop, just a second here. I forgot it had onion and green pepper it was supposed to have. Maybe it helped if I'd read the recipe the entire way, huh? Or is that my recipe? Yes. Hmm. Keep the oil. Cook. Hmm. I'm gonna have to start looking and reading because it doesn't say green pepper and onion in this. I must have picked up the wrong recipe. Darn. Okay, so we are going to hear it crack with crackling. We're gonna break up the rice a little bit here. Stick to my pan. All right, we're going to add our beans. And our corn, or, yeah. I debated on just cooking my beans. But then I decided to go ahead and do a can. And then we're going to add some corn. The kitchen shears here. more oil. Doesn't this look pretty? All right, we're gonna let that heat just a little bit longer. Then we'll pull it all over to one side, add a little bit more oil and um, cook some eggs. So seeing I've got this out though, and I, I am going to be making something with for tomorrow. Um, 
of our onion. of how cool our knives are. This is a paring knife. This cuts up so nice. I love the way our knives have fit in my hand. Um, the weight works really well. Um, a lot of knives, they feel flimsy in your hand when you're using them. But this one here is very sturdy. It fits my hand. I can cut with my right or left hand. And it, either way, it feels the same. I'm left-handed, so it really is nice to be able to cut with my left hand. I know I've picked up some knives and it's like, oh, yeah. It, it, it just doesn't fit right, but these do. And some of that could be because the founder um, is left-handed, which is kind of cool. All right, we're going to go ahead and add just a tad more oil. It's just so cool. And it is a glass bottom. Everything else is plastic or silicone, but the, the base is glass. All right, I'm gonna pour that in. We're gonna just let that sit for a minute while it heats a little bit. And we'll mix it all together after it's all done. Whoop, grab the wrong recipe again. Got to stop doing that. Um, you could top it off with avocado, chopped clan cilantro, um, green onions, salsa. And I'll probably open up a thing of salsa to put with it tonight. Um, and this southwestern... Seasoning is gluten-free, so that's a really cool. Um, it has a recipe on it for taco filling, so you can make your own taco seasoning out of it. So what's your favorite recipe? Have you thought about taste buds? Right now they're on sale, so it is a perfect time to get them. You get three seasonings, three recipes. Um, lots of times you can get like free shipping on certain products. Um, what else? Oh, so much. I don't know. My family normally enjoys at least one of the three recipes and they normally ask for more or go back for more every time um, which is really kind of weird because my family has uh, my husband and my son have always been the pickiest eaters For the month of September, 
You can get 20% off your taste buds. And that. Uh, And that's, you can get a one time, you can get um, a three month and a six month, I think. Um, I nor I have the three month that I normally do, but I've been thinking about going ahead because it's cheaper the more months you do, um, it, the cheaper it gets for you. So, all right, we're gonna stir this all back together. And see what we get. There we have Southwestern fried rice. But it's going to be hot. You think? Hot? Mm. Hot, but really good. Just the right amount of spice, a little hot, little not, beautiful.